welcome back. If you're new, welcome. Today I am sharing with you what I bought this month that is definitely worth sharing and talking about. Where should I start? I don't know, but I think I'm gonna go for stationery. <laughs> I went to Paper Chase, which is one of my favorite shops ever, and I found those cards. Honestly, guys, they are amazing. So. I have a big collection of postcards just in case one day I need to post and I don't have anything, I always have some. So I end up having plenty of birthday cards and any any situation really, any excuse again to buy cards. And I found these that I thought were absolutely gorgeous. Look, they're all nice colours as well. And they're between 150 and 175. There was a lot more choice, but they're the ones I picked. Um, I thought they were just beautiful you know what I was thinking even if it's just to keep in your room like this one for example a little note of happiness I thought would be quite cute the color and everything just in a room you know it doesn't have to be sent obviously it's better if you send happy birthday beautiful or you're my favorite person rather than keep in your room but I just thought they were super super cute and they're all made in the UK which is always a plus I like these kind of things so um, paper chase and a blank inside as well come with a little envelope and this one is holographic which I love I think it's just it looks so expensive and so beautiful so I can't wait for a birthday or anything to send these I love them so that's my first little favorite in stationery and then I bought some new sunglasses not because it's extremely sunny in London not at all but um, only because I, I want a new, a new pair really it's just an excuse so I went on Asus and I found these they're from Lispec and tell me what you think so I quite like them black at the top and like see-through here so the branches are see-through I thought it was quite cute it was a bit different so I can wear it anytime I wear black which is almost every day <laughs> I'll wear them because they just go with everything I like the shape which is kind of close to the ray but let's say it um, and yeah I found them really cute they don't look too they don't look cheap and they were only like 35 pounds so I'm quite happy with them that's my second favorite of the month definitely those sunglasses third favorite will definitely go to a French product I went home for a couple of weeks in uh, July and I bought some new uh, moisturizing cream so I bought this one. So this one is from Le Petit Marseillais, which is obviously a very big brand in France of all uh, cleaning and washing products. I decided to go for a moisturizing cream for the body. So I had a surgery recently and my entire body went really dry uh, because of that. So I finished every single cream that I had in my home so when I went to France I thought it would be the opportunity to try something new obviously I got a massive bottle as you can see it's the maxi format of 400 milliliters it smells amazing it feels amazing it definitely definitely moisturizes and it's a bit you know like it feels a little bit like water you know when it's like it's not sticky that's it it feels like it just where it's gonna dry perfect and honestly it smells really really good so this one is almond and poppy almond and poppy I'll definitely recommend I'm not sure you can find it in London but if you do travel to France this summer that's one to get definitely one to get this is something I got for my birthday which I'm gonna be cheeky it was in June but I've been trying it out over the few weeks and I am in love it's the Mac eyebrow pen crayon for my birthday I wanted to try something new I thought Mac must do the best and honestly I am not disappointed uh, the brush is really nice and really thick and the color so I took the deep dark brunette it's perfect every day I use it it doesn't look too much it brushes away very nicely I sometimes use the brush only to just brush them up to just so they kind of clean and neat I am really happy with that it was quite expensive but it's Mac so I guess that's the deal um, but I'm really happy with the quality look it's been a month that I've been using it it's almost brand new so it doesn't disappear so quickly so I'm quite happy with that I definitely definitely recommend this one to stay in the cosmetic um, I wanted to talk about something that I have been using honestly for five years or six years or more every single day I start my beauty routine with that 
and it's Clinique the one two three. It's the three steps to uh, great skin basically. So I've been using it every single day. So you start with the soap, then with the clarifying lotion, and finally with the moisturizing cream. So this one is a little pack that my grandma got for me. It is for traveling for a weekend away. Uh, and it comes in like super small bottles like that but I have the massive massive bottles usually because I use it every day so it is expensive but it is definitely worth it yeah that's definite for like every day I want to show you one thing as well it is a sippy cup I think it looks so American but honestly it is so handy so I use it I put water in it but I also put smoothies sometimes and it's basically very big as you can see as it's big I fill it in with water and I try and drink like two or three a day so I think this is quite a good solution it looks good you know it's simple easy to clean uh, quite safe so you screw the top basically you see um, that, that, that. and yeah perfect I found it on Amazon it wasn't cheap but it came with two so there were two in the box so I think I'm gonna use one in the office and one at home and I want to finish on something fun so when I had my surgery I was a bit stuck at home and I thought I wanted some colors in my room and I wanted some fun and what I was using all the time was my phone so I looked around and I found a really really cool phone case uh, so this is the one I am so happy about it it basically is see-through with glitters and little sparkles and stars in it that come down and up and down so you can't see it when you're on the phone or when you're on your phone but if you're bored you just look at it it's quite cute and honestly it looks, it looks beautiful that I found on Skinny Dip which is a British brand, I think. Their prices, their, it is not cheap, I'll say, for a phone case, but I must admit that it is protecting my phone and it is looking cute. I took see-through because they have a lot of like things with prints and stuff. I thought the see-through one was quite cute because I actually never got to see the back of my phone before, so I think that was quite nice because I had an Apple case before and it was just grey, plain grey. So I thought, you know, a bit of colour, a bit of fun, you get to see the phone that you paid a lot for. And it's protected. So yeah, the phone case costs, costs it costs I think the 15 pounds. You know it's this kind of things that you think I won't buy it for myself, but if someone buys it for me, I'll have it. I think phone cases are that. So yeah, I did spoil a bit of my um, my family with a few and my friends. So I'll definitely definitely get you to have a look on this website. They always have sales and clearance. So, and that is it for this month. I showed you everything so far body cream to stationery to sunglasses to body and face cream and eyebrow pencils and a phone case I thought it was quite a wide range I hope you liked the video and thank you for watching I hope to see you next week next week see you next week bye 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 bye